perfect is this not perfect I have. <coughs> I trust my own. This is still there. Yeah. Some progress. But is this really important? No, it's just. It's just Or the proof to point, or the light at the end, the righteousness, the fucking thing. <sighs> the thing is, how we got here? Oh, I got here. Hmm. Two hmm. sixty years of fun. More or less, for sure, bad experiences, Jesus, and good ones, really good ones. So, a lot of people told me, hey, your life is uh, mm -hmm. two lives together. Yeah, I'm a twin. 21st of June, 216. I would never believe that my first day had any anything. It's not true. It was like it was. It's the you know. It's the beginning of summer. Summer solists. I always say they were born on the morning of a Sunday. <sighs> I was a lucky child from the get-go. Wonderful childhood. Wonderful mother. I thought I was like, eh. Yeah, but it told me I have to be a young father and and then I still fucked it up. <laughs> but without that I would know a lot of things and I would not have lost the unconditional love of my wife. You know you have to lose some things that you can really appreciate them. I'm still fighting to get it back. Even, even yeah, it cannot be the same as it was. No. But maybe I still hope. Maybe it's the reason I'm still here. Yeah, because it's never the problem of the people they go; it's the problem of the people they stay. So anyway, I have nothing to do with anything. So, but now my, 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 <laughs> my next grandchild is on the way. Yeah, let's say it is. Let's say it is in planning. Never say it's sure. Never say you have to let it have the flow. Otherwise, you're asking for troubles. <laughs> I had to learn this lesson too. Because my wishes got fulfilled. It took a while. But my wish was. Hey, I wish I'm, the, I'm, I'm on the cover of the surf magazine and the middle poster and breaking records and doing all the things what I did. I dreamed about it and I remember when I was at this first surf magazine and saw it. I will be on this page. Yeah, took a while, but you know. <laughs> the impossible the impossible we can do right now, but the wonders take a while. And we can't say it differently because I was coming out of a town. The next place to windsurf was fifty miles away. So, I could start with 18, because you need a car to transport the board. And, but the thing was, it was completely new. There was nobody else younger. Sure, there was young people starting with me at the same time. Like, uh, Dungabek. I was going surfing with him, with, 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 he was 12, 13, he was like just a little boy. I brought him to the beach and I saw right away, oh, this motherfucker will fuck them all. Yeah, and he did. 
and I had some fights with him in speed contest and you had to admit, uh, yeah, the guy is fast <laughs> and strong. <laughs> I have an interview from him where he said that, fast and strong. So, that's okay. And the, the funny thing about the whole situation is that he's such a stupid motherfucker. Unbelievable. He tries, still tries to get the world record, right? And he didn't learn. Because I can tell him right now, huh, baby? Why you don't use a speed suit in a speed contest? How you can be that stupid? Sorry, you would be one note faster. Look at your fastest time, one note to it. Where you would be. Hmm? Yeah. Jesus. I mean, the suit that I was using, <laughs> you could already feel it when you just st st are standing in the wind. Because normally you could push back or forward and you feel right away there is less push and this means less resistance and means faster. Stupid fucks. These speed suits using by a uh, water ski contest where it makes slaloms where it's really important that you actually have less resistance that you make the turn in it. So, yeah, I was the stupid one using a speed suit and the other ones was the smart ones, right? Use it, don't use a speed suit. So, uh, what do you think about right now? So, I'm telling you, I have plans. It depends what comes out in the 40 days, but I have plans to break the record again. Yeah, I will beat you, motherfucker. I'm the old guy. Actually, I shouldn't lose, lose too much weight. Ah, anywho. <sighs> yeah. So, yeah, I have actually three plans. I have actually kiting, windsurfing, and a boat. And the boat is so crazy, I can't believe it. <laughs> One thing I didn't send out. All other shit to send out because yeah, make something <coughs> really normal, as complicated as possible. 3D printing have his yeah. not even cost much, but nobody has a lighter like this. Anyway. Yeah, you see, I'm the stupid one. Can construct this and just think of it. Anyway, <sighs> where was I? Where this all started? So, I didn't know it at this time, but I was living the dream. You know, I was traveling around the planet, surfing big waves and this feeling of surfing big waves with whatever windsurf or without windsurf but you get pushed by nature in this crazy way yeah riding the tubes yeah I did that not very often because I was windsurfing but then there was no wind it was blowing in the morning and yeah sometimes you get lucky and then I have a perfect day and then you make the first tube ride and you think, what the hell is this? This is crazy addict addictive, I would say, but, you know. <sighs> Anywho. So, but the thing was, I remember the day I was on the water Somewhere between Hukipa and on Maui, Hawaii, and surfing, and I was thinking, I'm doing something wrong. It's not that much fun anymore. And then I realized I, I don't share it with somebody. So I stopped this single life, go back to. Europe, 
got a little bit more with sales and yeah I was even there I was, I was working for first for Noah's yeah and there was Eckhart he was a he was a guy who saw things in people where other people didn't see he see he saw that I was you know this crazy guy who can build incredible things so he said hey make me a speed sale here yeah, you have money go to Legata and here yeah, make the prototypes it's fun to do that and then I was going to South Africa and I was not singing about it anymore I didn't have even the templates with me it was and then I got a call hey you should go to uh, 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 <laughs> at this time it was Bombay, India. One of the craziest, craziest thing I encountered there. I was landing there and man, people always saying, you know, Africa is a really bad place and for South America, no, no, no. no. Nicky Lauda actually said once, that's, that's the worst place on the planet, and the worst town, city, whatever. <sighs> because they have this cast, casting uh, uh, belief system, so when you're not in a cast, you are nobody. You mean nothing. Really, <coughs> not even existing on this planet for them. So I was going with a cab, and several lanes going crazy and then we have to the left and to the right flat heads flat, you know little heads that people live in the, you know built out whatever they found and little kids you know running around the street and so take careful the kids and said yeah yeah there, there, there are problem what do you mean with that i always looking for an english speaking driver and then like driving around and so you're getting information. So he said, "Yeah, yeah we have a problem." I said, "Why?" He had been making uh, these bigger kids making dents in the car. Mm. That was his concern. That his kids will make dents in this car. That's the reason he actually drive around them because you know otherwise yeah anyway but they're not bad people that's their belief system so eh, it's like that but these people housing in there the house are, whew, when I was born in one of these huts <laughs> how much chance you had to go any, do anything Funny thing about this crazy poor people out there are seem, seemingly happy, so I, 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 I don't get it. But the thing is, it's always what your neighbor have, right? When you have something to eat and your neighbor don't have anything to eat, and you share it, it's the best feeling in the world. Yeah. But you can only have this feeling when you have really nothing and you share nothing. It's crazy it is because you're sharing the half of your owning with somebody. Do the rich people that are still know that they, they say, oh, we're making so much money, yeah, yeah, we're making so much money, so. But anyway. So that was really a lesson to me that. Ooh, you are a fucking lucky guy and whenever I was in a bad situation, mood or whatever, I said, hey, Bombay, okay, everything is fine, oh, thank you. So anyway, thing was, I was there making the speed sales and then I was in the and uh, it was so crazy that, because of built them there, so it worked there very well. So there was this test with the 
people who were willing to sail the ship and <laughs> nobody was using David Essies to a big superstar sailmaker, only they were using my street sailors and they heard it. Was not, was not on there because I made them. So he was packing his things and make an ultimatum to the bosses of Norse with me or him and thinking, oh, he is the cheaper guy to get rid of, so, oh, let's do that. And did the decision on the end, because <laughs> ah, normally, you know, you, you, you give them one year money that they don't go right away some, to somebody else. Oh, not this guy, he is too stupid to do anything, right? Oh, okay. So we're sitting there, making the contract, you know, money or two bad. I said, so when I read this right, before we already signed the contract, uh, I can do whatever I want. Right? Mm -hmm. I said, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm starting tomorrow with gun sales. Going to China and, yeah, you will lose a lot of money. Bye. And they did. Yeah, but then I get packed up from this gun sales guy. <laughs> Yeah, he took the money on board the airplane. Hmm. Did I wish for that? That he burst in flames and crashed to the ground? No, not that I don't remember. But I told him don't do that because he has, you can't even drive a car properly. You shouldn't use an airplane. So anyway, first day, got the plane. Luckily, the family said, oh, try you first. So, he crashed and burned. So, you know, doing me wrong, you know, I don't know, but it happened to a lot of people. Anyway, the thing is, I didn't know that maybe I was involved in this situation just by thinking about it. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure I wished for it and then it happened. Is this my fault that my wish come true? No. Not at all. And then he fucked me over really, really bad. Was it wrong to wish that he get back the favor? No. I don't think so. Could be trash and burn. I told him not to do it. What should I tell him? <coughs> God bless, nothing worse. God, they, they, we will we'll do the, the whole weather situation. <laughs> When they tell you, yeah, we have to prepare for the heat. No, we should actually do the other thing. But, yeah, I'm depressed. So where I was, you know, when people do me wrong. <sighs> so do me wrong, you will see what you have. Just thinking about it. I'm digressing again. So uh, how did that? But the thing was, <laughs> one little detail, you know, you have to think about, it was <laughs> 80s, right? Around 80s to the 90s. I had a, 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 a cut out my sails, you know, built this all on my own, do you want? Uh, with a laser cut, a big one. You know, five meters long, three meters wide, and the way the chest is here. Because it was sick and tired to throw it on my knees, cutting shit out. Right? And I told the guy, listen, we have to make our own R&D, otherwise we will end up over a second. And I told him, listen, I promise you, we win every race when we do that. I need this and this amount of money, and we will do it, and when this will work. 
you make a contract, I want to have a piece of the pie. This is not enough factor already. And you know already what's coming up, right? We won everything. With my production series. Fucked up Noah's, fucked up New Bride, fucked up of everybody. We got a little, little, little team. Three guys, one girl. One, first, second, third, and the girls that all races in one year. Okay. Nothing to see here, right? But anyway, even the world record, an open water record, in front of the from our one race. He was just one tenth in front of me, and I was like, ah. But I had to do a lot of other things to support them and give them everything, and I was just competing on the side and was second. Anyway, it was perfect. It was American, American market. It was, it was really doing something. And I decided, hey, it's much cheaper to fuck me over, right? Much cheaper. Yeah. That all these beer money guys have always the same problem. They only see the money. Oh, it's much cheaper to get rid of him. Yeah, but maybe it would be much more money when we... You no, know, he promised the impossible. He made the impossible happen. And then you say, oh, somebody else had the idea. It was like, what? What are you talking about? So the thing was, I had this laser cutter standing there. And that, that's the oldest the thing they don't see what I was programming the whole shit at home until uh, I don't know, six o'clock in the morning because I had to do this 3D shit all in my head. It was only 2D. So they were thinking I have these constructions coming out of the machine. Now it was coming out of here. I have to check that. It's still working. Oof. Yeah, because sometimes, that was last time I was talking for an hour, and then I found out it was not running. That really fucks you up. <coughs> anyway. <sighs> so there it is. So, you know, I had uh, production boards and records, everything I've uh, built and done. You know, was successful actually, and still people are thinking, eh, he's so complicated. Yeah, I have, a, I have a mind on my own, and when I think I'm right, it's hard to, you know, you have to do this with logic. It's I told all of my, my boys when I work with them, listen, when you're just saying things, I'm not listening. You have to come with an argument, with logic. And then I will consider it. And then it just says, yes, yes, do this like that, do this like this. I always told them the whole story. I mean, fast forward to building supercars. Just before the shit hits the fan. Actually, it was a couple of years before then. I was, I was competing in World Championship and I said, listen, I have an idea. One of the most important things in Rallycross is the start. When you are in the first, because you're starting first, always in a line and first, uh, who is for first in the f first corner, <laughs> you know, he will get first three going up. He will, he will, he will automatically go into the next one. VW was cheating like hell and nobody I, I knew it is the whole time I told them and nobody hey, okay. yeah I was I was in Sweden training with my brother I actually beat the local and, and the, the team was so happy about it that somebody shut the fuck up for them so but nobody said hey he's first time in a 
car like that and he's faster than our guys here? Should we recognize it somehow? No, my brother was angry about me because five seconds behind he was no better. Anyway, what should I say? But there was VW there <laughs> two weeks beforehand and I asked him, is anything special about the car you saw it in the, in the car? He said, yeah, he said, no. Long uh, uh, metal uh, uh, rods and on these rods was mounted uh, weights. No, great idea. If you can really put the, make a really light car, then you put the weights on down there and then you can move the weight to this per perfect spot. What I didn't recognize that it was because it was not allowed to do that. And the rule book was you can make this weight, but you have to fix it somewhere. And they found the weak spot. I said fi it's fixed, but you still can move it. <laughs> you know, VW can do that. So I knew about these weights, and I was wondering why they are always winning the starts and how the hell when they put the weights there for the perfect position for the start, it's a little bit more back, but then you would have problems with the jumps. And they was jumping like whoa, all four wheel too. Like, how are they doing that? And I said, they're moving the fucking weights. You make the start a number position and then you push a button and it goes forward. But uh, you know, <laughs> they build a frame with mean, the whole thing and they put the second floor in there. You couldn't see it because it didn't make the 3W, it didn't make the whole. So it was moving in there, nobody knew. So. Anyway, but VW are cheating, right? We know that with the exhaust. Thing. So, so I had this idea we have to do something about the start. So, thank you for the start. to we have this metal rods was going from left to right to we push this one wheel up it is it's, it's stabilized of course and we have put there a mechanic there but it, when it holds it down when the wheels are down it snaps in and on the back wheel too so the whole car is completely on the bottom at this moment you push the start and release the brakes up. You push the wheels down and you start to feel it really like you want it. So it's a start automatic, but uh, no, MotoGP have, and I had this idea three years before that, so, and they said, no, it's too complicated to try this out. So that's stupid, these people. Were. I said, it costs us nothing. You can just mount it to a car and try it out, and when it works, you will fuck everybody up. No, 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 we don't do that. No, it, this, <laughs> they didn't know at this time that I was demonized. You know, to my brother. He said, yeah, Michael, it's, it is just crazy. And you no, know, you're telling all this crazy stuff. And we had to push him out from the test team because he was not really happy with the car. Of course, you not because it was bullshit. So, I was the only, <laughs> my brother was like, oh, why these people are always against my brother? Yeah, because <laughs> I was right and they was wrong. <sighs> it's the same shit happened the last three years, you know, demonizing people. But the problem is, even he is right with something, <laughs> completely, and probably they knew it. But he couldn't say yes to that because they would say, hey, we demonized this guy. We, we can't we can't say that that is actually a good idea because we would look stupid. And they were stupid, that's the problem. These people always are stupid. They're just Yeah, you know, the forty guys there and it was really, really the same thing like in a uh, government. 
just uh, looking out that he looked good for the horses and kicking down. So should I wish for that that he get all fired and I can do it. Was it my fault that he was get fired? No, I don't know. Not in this rule book here, but actually I did. Was it planned that all these other things have to happen? No. <laughs> you know, I think that was a coincidence. That my plans was going with other plans together somehow. <laughs> like, to bring me in a good mood. 2020. You know? In the early days of 2020. Hmm. And I have, I have the tweet now. So. The thing is 2020, but I was this tweet out that the guy with the blue sweater <laughs> said that his company, the name of his company, <laughs> have something to do with the uh, size and the condition of his penis. It's not my idea. I wish it was. I dreamt about this joke. I saw this joke in front of me. I'm performing this jo joke on the stage and I told my son about it and he said, hey, this joke is old. What? I never heard about it. I said, no, no. Here. 2020. This thing is out already. And then, this is not possible. How I could miss that? I would use this a million times. Just for the fun of it. Huh. Yeah. When you're looking for a reason, that's one. Like the sitting together. Hey, we, we have this in planning for a long time, right? Could we do it now because I have the money and the power to do it? Because otherwise it comes out that I have a, a micro penis and it's soft as well. <laughs> I, I, I don't know, I always, because it's such an asshole, yeah, he deserves to suffer, <laughs> anyway, any way you want it, so, thing is, Yeah, yeah, I'm obsessed with geometrical things and I didn't know at this time why I'm constructing a pyramid. But we will go there. So anyway, the whole shit starts and I had I had no I had no problem with that because I, I was after two weeks I knew what was going on. I mean there was old people dying, there was sick people dying, like it was the year before with the flu. <laughs> so, what's the whole fuss about it? But it didn't stop, and da 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 da, and everybody got afraid, like hell, and like, what, what are you talking about? Look at the numbers. But when you say the numbers, are like, ah, you wanna kill everybody. Ah. We know now that was all. Part of the group. So, why they did that? Yeah, first of all, they had to hide the fact that he is a he have a micro penis. <laughs> so, one good reason. The second was control, for sure, control. Like they always do with these funny disasters.
be making no sense at all. And you wonder how this can happen and the only way this all can happen, probably somebody wished for it. <laughs> so anyway. <sighs> yeah. We know now that all that shit was for nothing and you know. I mean I'm some kind of living proof of it because I did 100% the opposite thing what the told I, I was going out and I was doing that, I was not against the rules. I was had to go to the supermarket sometimes and had the fucking mask on, but I had a really big beard at the time, funny, right? Because I found out when I have a beard, you, you can put this on and you can see it. Yeah, this was just, you know, virtual signaling, because otherwise people would start Hey, there is no sickness around. Why are we doing this? Oh, right? We need to see the masks. So. Anyway. And to ease in the shot, right? Because when you make a lot of shitty things happen for people. Masking, staying at home, telling every week another lie, and oh, finally. Testing with this nose, I mean, I still get, don't get it. How could anybody with a living soul let this happen to them? I think everybody who tested with the nose are uh, actually, I don't know what they are, but I, I can't believe them because I've tried it once. And they told the guy, you know, you have two chances. You put the stick in your own nose now and walk out of here. Or you will know how often you can I can ram this in you and all the other sticks they're laying around you. So shut up and <laughs> go quietly out of this room and sit there. Luckily he did. Because he was determined to kill him. If he tried it. Because I told him, listen, when some of the sticks are piece of wood up here. You could kill me with a little nudge. So how the hell I would let this happen? Never. And he knew that. He was searching for these people who are resisting this shit. That's what they want to know. You know? So the, when these people are looking for, you know, 10% of the population, as they say. World Economic Forum. But it's so as here, it, uh, it's just, uh, it's just, who would put really this guy in front, who is have a German accent, I mean, <sighs> anyway, it's here, it's just here. I'm not so afraid of any fucking thing. Yeah, fuck that. Anyway, so they're making everybody afraid of nothing. And you know, interestingly, One meter, one second, just that chance. No, everything is constructed, you have to just get over it. Anyway, he again. I can't lie when I have this thing on. Um, so now I'm lying. I'm anyway a demon, so I'm lying anyway. So what? I used to be demonized, so. Fuck this little motherfucker. 
Let the other dream is just exploding in this moment. These stupid motherfuckers are onto something and they don't even know it. But I can tell you right now, the truth lays very often in the middle. <laughs> I don't say what I mean with that because yeah, that would destroy most me for everybody. Yeah, that's the problem. With the whole situation. Nobody would like the truth. They would be hide it. Some people know the truth, and that's the problem to exploit the system, and that's the reason I'm here. So, hmm. yesterday that was making me nervous because it turns first. Then actually it turns back. I don't have a second. Yeah, but just think about it and it will turn back. Come, go to the right, go to the right. I can do that. Oh, oh look at that. What a fucker does it. Anyway. So with this whole situation, even I was not really affected by it. I mean, I mean, it was the only country in the whole world who brought this whole injection ship to law. You could, you, yesterday I had this discussion with my friend, Marcus. He's always on the right side of history. Right? He's my... I told him yesterday, you, you have such an important role in this whole part. Because you, I have always to fight with you and... Um, make my arguments sharper until he couldn't say anything and that he, he, he was doing this fight with COVID like crazy and then I found out oh shit I'm doing here the wrong thing because as long he believes that was okay And you know, you, 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 there is this crazy thing about this shots. Now the data coming out now, that the first patches are really dangerous. The second patches was uh, middle, and the last one was nothing. Hmm, how come? I know. When you ask, There is this funny saying, you know, like the, the three things you get when you get the COVID shot, you know, heart disease, some blood class, and COVID. <laughs> Man, that's, that's so the truth. And the plan is that really a lot of people should die from it. You know, we didn't expect that the stupid creation of them, this virus, are actually a living thing. Yeah, they are a living thing, but you think it's a single thing. No, when they start out from one you know, cell, they are connected. And we have to prove for that, but nobody believes the proof because it can't be. So, oh. But the whole situation proves it. It was really bad in the first place, and then it got slower and slower, even it was still in the wild, so... So, it has to be a virus in the end. Otherwise it wouldn't change. So lucky we was. Yes and no. Because that means that the people that was doing that are the stupid ones. They, have, they, they don't have a clue what's really going on. They're still believing they're an 
and the water <laughs> of anything but you know, just little muppets. Anyway, there it was. Ah, before I start, it's too far to look. Is this still running? Because I don't want to start with it. If I don't, um, yeah. I know, still fat. Yeah, so. Mm. 